Quarterback Tools and Tactics, we have the Top Test Combustible Gas Leak Detector from Top Test. This thing is awesome. I've been playing around with it. I'm not even a plumber or work on gas lines regularly. But this is one of my favorite tools. This thing is really cool. I'm going to show you how this thing is packed with features. You're going to want to see this. So you open this box, it comes with two batteries and the tester. Underneath here though, they actually come with a branded top test pouch here for you. So if you're going to put this in your tool pouch, because it is a sensitive measuring instrument, it'll help you keep it safer in one of the slots of your pouch or tool bag, whatever you got. First off, this thing has 75 decibel ticks and the ticks vary in the sensitivity. So as you sense more gas, the ticks get stronger and so on. They vary depending on what the concentration of combustible gas is. We're gonna turn this on. You see the background is green. When this senses gas, the background turns red. Really cool feature. One of my favorite features of this that's absolutely necessary is that it has like a constant status bar that lets you know that this tool is still active, which is really important for a testing tool because you know, one, the tool is still on, two, the tool is still sensing, three, that it's not just stuck on a screen and it's gonna give you a false reading. Now, after you turn this on, this thing's gonna beep twice and we're gonna hear it, there you go. There's two beeps, that means it's 30 seconds. We can now enter low sensitivity mode. You hit this button and you enter low sensitivity mode. The difference would be in high sensitivity mode when the tool is first turned on, it's going to get a reading within five seconds. In low sensitivity, it only takes two seconds. I recommend if you're going to use this to test gas, that you always use it in a low sensitivity mode for the best results. Just like any tester, whether it's electrical, whatever it is, you never want to use a tester like this as a sole means to verify that the gas is off. If you're checking fittings and things like that, this is good to verify, okay, probably don't have any leaks, everything looks good. Go ahead and spray some soapy water on it to see if your bubbles form or not. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. I've just turned this on in about 30 seconds. This is gonna do a double beep. And it's gonna allow me to go into low sensitivity mode. And there it is right there. It says caution. Instrument is used after 30 seconds of warm up after startup. Sensitivity 50 ppm. There you go. So that's what we're doing. We're about to get a double beep. Any second now, there we go. Push this button here. That light turns off. Now what we're going to do, you know the gas is off because we turned it off. The, it, it is shut off. The only amount of gas is residual that's in this line. The gas is not constantly flowing. We're going to turn these dials on here. We're going to see if we can pick up a reading. So here we go. There you go. Let's turn it off. Let's see if it's still in the area. No more in the area. Let's see if we can pick up on this burner here. Turn that back off. I'm still picking up on it. But, I mean, that's pretty cool. All right, here we are at our stove. We are in low sensitivity mode. This is natural gas. Turn that on. We pick it up immediately.
And if we turn it to high sensitivity mode, just just barely, you're getting a little bit of a reading there. Turn it back on here. There you go. This thing works really good. So we cleared the area. I'm leaving the gas on. We're going to see how close we can get. And to show you there is gas, we'll go ahead and ignite it. There you go. There is one thing they wanted me to mention here, that this thing has a clear plastic film to protect the LCD screen. So I'm going to peel that off here for you. There you go there. The company's response and customer service and just in general how much they care and the amount that they know about this tool was really surprising and I'm really happy to be working with them. Top Test reached out to me and sent me this tool and wanted me to do a test on it. And after checking out their website and also talking to people online, I determined that this was definitely worth looking into. And you guys will probably be happy to own one of these. I think they're like $20 on their website. I've never seen anything like this before. I've never seen anything like this this small. They do make other testers. This one here is the PT199. It does have a five minute timeout, so after five minutes this tool will shut itself off. So it will save your battery. In all of my testing, this tool has performed flawlessly. I think it's worth your time to check it out. It's 20 bucks. I'm really impressed with it. It's done everything that it says it can do. And just the, the attention and the settings and just everything about it. It's, it's just really impressive. It really is. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thanks for watching.